Jolly Christmas. Those are them to know and everyone you meet. It's Christmas season! Finally! It's my favorite time of the year, as is probably everyone's. It's just the best. So I am now at my mom's house. I came over here to go for a walk with her. She wanted to chat and stuff. So we're going to go to the park, um, one of my favorite parks here in Orlando, go for a walk. The weather is so beautiful and it's perfect for feeling like the Christmas season. We just decorated the whole house um, with Christmas yesterday. We had our, our family Thanksgiving yesterday. It's a little later than Thanksgiving, but um, my mom was only available yesterday, so and today. And she also gave me my birthday presents yesterday because I won't see her for my birthday, and this is one of the things she gave me, so we're gonna test this out today. It's binoculars, but it's also a camera. So you look through and you zoom in. It goes like 10 times zoom, she said, and you zoom into whatever it is you're looking at, like a bird or, I mean, who knows what. But And then you take a picture, but you can't see the picture until you put it on the computer. Um, anyway, it's cute and I like it. And so we're just going to test that out today. And what else? What else? I feel like there was something I was going to say, but um, now I'm just starting to sound like that friend that calls and doesn't have anything to say and you're like oh so you called cuz oh I just want to say hey and you're like okay and that turns out really awful for me because I am a very quiet and not much of a conversationalist so then I just sit there like not knowing what to say and everything so <laughs> anyways that's what this is turning into but the opposite so yeah, I don't know how much I'm going to vlog today because I don't have a whole lot going on. Um, so I think what I'll do is I'll just put this at the beginning of my St. Augustine uh, trip because we went there just for the day and I know someone was requesting a little tour. This isn't a tour, it's just kind of clips from the trip. Um, I didn't have time to actually plan out a nice tour and we didn't get to do even half of the things we were planning on doing so but there's still a lot um anyway so I think that's what I'll do so enjoy <laughs> see they're Look putting the it up boat. so the sailboat can, boat can go through. See a sailboat with a really tall um, uh, sail and the um, mass that holds the sail. There he goes. What are we doing? You don't know? We are at Fort Meg. What do you know? Where are we at? Fort McKansas. Kansas? Matanzas. Matanzas. In St. Augustine. And it's Caleb's first fort of the day. Are you excited? Yeah. Oh, don't go on the road. Oh, don't splash in that. Look, you don't have your splash shoes on. You got your, your cool nifty shoes on. Caleb really wants to climb this tree. This is the ultimate climbing tree. I mean, you could just go forever. But we're going to wait on that till later. What? You want to go? Oh, there's a car. Come on. Coo -coo. Coo -coo. Like the other ones do. But first of all, they have these little leaves that look like this. That are cool like this. But they also have little bumps on them sometimes. And these up here do. Let me see if I can show you the ones that do. Yeah, and I can feel it. See? See, now look. You, now look, look, look. Do you see the little bumps on the leaves? Oh, I see little. See how they have those little bumps? Isn't that cool? Those are ferns. We, we, we've uh, kayaked out here before, don't oh, you? Yeah. Did you remember? And when, and when we kayaked, we saw the fort. Yeah. And it was in, it was, it was, it's on the island. And I was like, how do you get to that? And there's only one way to get to it. You have to 
paddle stick. You can't just. Wasn't our service daddy? Because, well, we just take a look. What do you think? <laughs> So there's a bit of an accident happened here. <laughs> stuff, what would you bring? Food, armor, what else? A lot of protection. Protection like what? Like the armor is kind of like protection.
Okay, you almost had it because that's right. Oh, oh, oh. So with, with, with this type of thing, you, you go over, under, over, under. That's how you use these. Lisa's gonna go. Did you go up? What? To the lighthouse yet? No. I don't have to go. You should go up. Caleb can't go. I don't know. I don't and go I don't want to go. I don't know. But Lisa can take a picture and show you what it looks like at least. Um, okay. 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 No, I'm, I've never seen what it looks like at the lighthouse. No, I'm saying like from the view because the view is different. It is not tiny. Oh, what is that? Look inside of it. faces for you. Come here.
I came back to the car to charge my phone. The lighting in here is horrible, so if you can't see me, I'm sorry. Um, and basically, we are now in the central part of St. Augustine, kind of like where the main fort is on the other side of, uh, or the Bridge of Lions, I think is what it's called. And so we're going to be walking through the main town and exploring that, going to the fort. And then um, from there, we, after all of that, we're going to be going to, on like a trolley that's going to take us around St. Augustine and um, show us all the lights and everything for Christmas. Like it's all decorated and lit up for Christmas and that's what I'm like super excited about because I don't think I've ever been to St. Augustine during Christmas before so that'll be so much fun um, so I'm really excited about that and another great thing is that it's been really cold today well cooler than normal um, and it's supposed to be really cold tonight so and by really cold I mean like Florida cold which is like 50s <laughs> so but it'll really feel like Christmas it'll put us in the Christmas spirit and kick off December um, you know just with festiveness I'm really excited about that. Um, yeah, so it's still November, but we're ready because Thanksgiving was yesterday and now it's just time. It's just time for Christmas. So, yay! And I'll bring you along, of course. So we'll get to that soon. Also, quickly, um, while I'm waiting for my phone to charge, I'm reading about No Stone, Stone Unturned. I don't know if you've ever read that book, but it's the true story of the world's premier forensic investigators and it's kind of the story about how the first forensic investigators started and what they did and things they explored and just so yeah that's what well, that's what I'm reading all kind of things I'm interested in and I know it's not very festive it's like but yeah it, it's really ex exciting and cool for me so I'm starting that and so, anyway so it's just kind of cool um, but that's what I'm doing while I'm waiting for my phone to charge and hopefully it won't take too long But it is going really slow. I think it's only at 26% now I'm trying to get it to 100 before I walk back down there uh, So maybe if I stop using it, it'll go a little faster. What do you think? Okay, bye <laughs> It says keep off cannons. But you can look at them. Well, you can touch them? Yeah.
on the, on the trolley to see the lights. I think they gave us two kids and one adult. They did. They gave us two kids and one adult. Caleb, what happens when you put your lights on? Are you going to wear your glasses? 